What's good, y'all? Welcome back. Today, we're going to be reacting to Swoozy's middle school class president. Now, I haven't reacted to a Swoozy video in a minute, so I was like, why not? Let's uh, let's react to something new. Uh, original video link will be down in the description. Let's get into the video. I went to this private school for a few years, and on the campus, they had kindergarten all the way to high school. And when I was 13, I would have to wait after school for one of my parents to pick me up. So yeah, I get hired to wait in one day. I started walking around school, and I saw where the kindergartners and the first graders have daycare on the playground. And I'm like, you know what? I should go fight these kids. I don't know why that was what? the first thought that popped into my head. That's it was a real thought. fighting, okay? It was play fighting. Relax. But I just walked over to the gate, opened it up. The teachers have seen me around school, so they know I go there. And I would just start play fighting. So here's the weird part. I love <laughs> that power of having like 15 kids charging at me. You know, just taking them all out. I'm not what? exaggerating, I'm not lying, not kidding. This was like a daily activity for me i never told anybody this this nigga just went around yeah. fighting children i'm batman and you what? guys picked the wrong day to rob gotham national city bank <laughs> yeah uh, this nigga's wild wait for my parents to pick me up now looking like i just came from a fight club every day so then one day in actual class miss thompson gets up so apparently we have to have like a class president to teach you guys about elections or some crap. I don't know. Why am I even doing this? I'm the home <coughs> teacher. This is a job for your, your history teacher or something. Who wants to be class president? We need to pick three people. So me on this power kick that I'm on. I raised my like me. What me, please. Pick me. Plus, there's this girl in my class, Jane, that I had a really big crush on. I partially wanted to impress her. She could be my little, my little first lady squeeze. So yeah, I, I can't. raised my hand and Tina B and Jeremy W. My cousin Shane was in my Jeremy class, so I picked him as my vice president. Tina B picked Robin. Jeremy, I don't think he even picked the vice president. He was just riding solo. And honestly, I don't know what I was thinking. You know, I was already leading a double life. But I was trying to do was the equivalent of Batman running Wayne Enterprises, fighting crime by night, and then running for mayor. High key. Need all the stress. Day before the election comes, Tina B comes in here with PowerPoints and graphs. She had pictures of her kissing babies in third world countries. What grade are y'all in? Wait a minute. Totally caught off guard looking at this like. Is he said middle school, grade, so. Or did I just step into an episode of West Wing? I'm very right? confused. Right? Like, and the teacher looks at me. Why are you trying so damn hard? It's your turn, I guess. I get up there. Um, I will make sure we get less homework. And everybody's like, yeah. 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 I mean, shit, I, I, I'm cheering yeah, for that too. Homework, first of all. Secondly, um, two hour lunches. Yeah. Also, okay, that's, um, that's a little ridiculous. For me, everybody here gets free puppies. Yeah, oh my God, yeah. What? I had the kids in my Bro. class so worked So the teachers are going to allow this? The SWAT team over. Okay, okay, settle down in here. Hi, right, Jeremy, you want to get up there and say anything? Mm-mm. You just going to let Tina... Go up on up there and kiss little babies from Haiti, and you ain't gonna do nothing. Uh-uh. Adan, they pretty much promised four-day weekend. You gonna sit there like a little punk? You ain't gonna do nothing? Damn. Mm -mm. Mr. So, you know, this whole campaign that I'm running for, I don't really flirt with Jane that much because I'm trying to stay focused. You know, I'm playing. I'm playing hard to get. The teacher gets up in front of the class. All right. Um. <sighs> I, I skipped breakfast. I'm getting kind of cranky. I'm going to go to Chick-fil-A. Everybody write Yo, it. Yo, Chick-fil-A sounds hella bomb. Pass it up. When I get back, I'll Fuck. come up and I want some Chick-fil-A. I'm out. I'm out. Do what it do. I'm out. And then Jane do what it do. My shoulder, and I'm figuring she's about to be like, good luck. I'm going to vote for you. That's what I'm figuring she's about to say, right? Pat on the shoulder. I'm like, what's up? Can you, can you, can you tap Sean for me, please? Sean is this light-skinned dude that sits in front of me he's six foot tall in the sixth grade i don't understand how, i don't know what hormone pills he's taking anyways sean turns around how about jane busts out with some sean will you be my boyfriend what you want to be my boyfriend <laughs> yeah okay this nigga hurt hurt <laughs> <Boats. laughs> okay uh. that's right Adonde is the class president. The instant I got it, I didn't even want it. Not even because of the whole Jane situation, right? I was like, fuck it, dude. Like, hey, I don't want to. I, I back out of my presidency. I can't deal with all the stress. You know, I got a full-time job, part-time job, school, bills, kids, bills. payment. I got all the stuff to worry about. I can't be dealing with any new responsibilities on my plate right now, okay? So when I resigned, 
Shane became acting president. Shane felt the power for like five minutes and then he was like, I resign. Jeremy, the one who put the least amount of work into all of this, ended up being the president. That's wow, like the this nigga had to say no words project. and got that shit. That was Jeremy. The only real winners in this was Jeremy and Sean. Let's be clear. But yeah, that's it. Thanks for uh, coming and listening to my TED Talk. All right. Yo, those animations were fire, bro. Like, those animations were fire. Uh, shit, that's just the GG. Did all that hard work just to just to win and then say, fuck it, I don't want it no more. That's just a waste of time. I never. I would never. But if you guys enjoyed the reaction, let me know down in the comments. Like I said, original video link be down in the description, and I will see you guys in the next video. I love y'all. Peace. I'm gonna pull up in that new thing.